Hey everyone, so I just wanted to do my skincare routine today and I thought that would be a good idea since I have really acne prone skin and um, I thought I would just show you what I use and I would show you like how I apply it and stuff. And as you can see, I'm in my bathroom. I would show you around my bathroom, but it's kind of really messy. And the reason I'm not filming in my room is because my room is really messy right now and um, I couldn't get like good lighting. Like this is natural lighting as you can see and um, in my bedroom it's not. So anyways, um, so I can honestly say I've never had the best skin as you can see. And I definitely do need to use um, some acne wash and cleanser and stuff and moisturizer. Um, my skin type is acne prone, my skin is very oily, and my skin um, is very sensitive. And so if you have those um, t that type of skin, then this might be good for you because I think I found like my perfect um, acne acne um routine i guess i would say so um the first thing that i use is the neutrogena oil free acne wash and it's the one that smells like grapefruit and it actually does smell like grapefruit so um all i would do is i just wet my face so i'm gonna wet my face with a towel and you want to use warm water to open up your pores for this and if you use cold water at the end of your skincare routine then it will close back up your pores so you won't get as much dirt in them and everything so I just do that and I just take one squirt on my fingertips and I just lather it up on my face it takes a little bit to lather up and I got that at Walmart for I believe nine dollars you might want to shop around for it because it is pricey. I like shop or drug mart or anything. And you just want to make little circles around your face. And this stuff doesn't lather up the best, I find, but it does work. But So you just wash that off with your hot towel. So you let that sit for a little bit and let it dry on your face. But I just tend to um, blot my face just to make this go a little quicker because I don't have all that much time to do this. Okay, so next I usually use like the proactive um, toner and I do switch up my products. I don't use just Neutrogena. I like, I use proactive, I use clean and clear and I use Neutrogena all together. So after that you wanna take a little, um, little paper towel or something and you just put that on there and you blot it all over your skin this stuff doesn't smell very good but I find it does work like everyone that reviews um, proactive I seem they seem to not like it and I do like it I don't like the renewing cleanser because it's like really scrubby and it feels like putting sandpaper on your face but the reviving toner is good so next i would just usually use the clean and clear acne spot treatment and i just put that on the spots that i have trouble with like you can see here that i have lots of trouble with that spot so i put that on there and this kind of burns when you put it on but if a product doesn't burn my face kind of thing, I don't think it's working. So I do think this works. And it minimizes my acne quite a bit when I wake up or something. The next day, I can see a quite a big difference. So then, after this, 
you would wait about two or three minutes or something and then you would use the clean and clear oil free moisturizer you would just put it all over your face and I got these two in a set and it came with a cleanser but I didn't like the cleanser very well because I find it made my skin oily the next day and I do not want my face oily than it already is so um I usually do this two times a day, night and day, so thank you for watching my acne routine, and I hope this helped you, and um, subscribe, comment, and like. Thanks, bye!